the as the number number ten, uh, number three uh, on <laughs> That's the train. A good point. Neymar into the middle and tripped up by Angban. That's going to be a free. Works and the ball turns over in transition with those two guys. You could be lethal. Finish that thought in a moment, but here you have Sadavi, who's pretty good himself. But it will be Neymar, the Brazilian, who steps in, strikes, and sends it whistling. Execution over, swirling, and just white. And we've seen Herrera strike a ball from distance. We've seen Paredes two weeks ago with a brilliant pass the corner. Yeah. Now that they are arguably one of the top two teams looking for the crun. But just missing out. And, and Poch is going to be happy. Poch is, is, is not going to be happy about maybe the finishing product, but the mere fact that Mbappe was very active in winning the ball, winning the ball back. And the Neymar when it comes to goals and assists. Lifted around the run. Santon scrambling back. Kurzawa. Get good 1v1 defending. That's that bending ball from Neymar of the overlapping Kurzawa. But X. Again, as you see here, Neymar wearing that number 10. The modern game, if you're going to have a playmaker, you have to let them have the freedom to do the unexpected. And sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Not allowing Paredes to get through that ball. This appropriate, considering you're taking on PSG Santons. Sometimes it seems like you need 111 players <laughs> to defend. It's amazing too in terms of equipment. Guys can get dry jerseys at halftime. Get him a get him a get a massage, and then <laughs> the camera not biting for this particular yet sponsorship shot. <laughs> Got to keep people happy. There it's the go. future of the game. Yep. And that's one of the reasons that Verratti's role is a bit different. Miss a link centrally, which he gives him now with pace. Six for six in his first six games. Very direct towards goal. Six months is right on that shy side yes, it is. of coming back from a, a ligament injury. And normally the rule of thumb is when you think you're ready, you got another month to go. But there's not that much time left in the season. So we're trusting the doctors. Jan is out there. But right now, it's Mess on defense. They can't afford to give up another goal here. Kija setting up the wall. Line just inside the 18 as Neymar steps into it. And it zooms over the crossbar. Very interesting, too, to see just the one-man wall. It's almost like Kija said. I Three goals as well. Not bad for a left back. Santos had been pushing forward. Neymar trying to take advantage. Touch to the front line, and Di Maria can't catch it clean. Flag stayed down, but it's meaningless as the shot rolls wide. Team, so to speak. And when you do that, good things will happen, i.e., the second goal. Oh, forward, letting it run through the modern game. Mbappe, Di Maria begging wide for Neymar instead. Trailing run, Herrera. They had Okija frozen, Mbappe, and if they can get that European crown that they just missed out last year. Backer inside the young left back tonight. The opportunity to slide the ball to Di Maria far post, just close. So the only option was shoelaces. Good save. Neymar. Santon's trying to keep him wide, does, bangs it back off the Brazilian, and it's out for the goal kick. Wide by Mbappe, and then he hits the accelerator. Back in for Mbappe. Has a square. Offensive play. What a play by Neymar, by the way. Takes it out of the air. Plays Mbappe through. The probably would have gone wide anyway, but good defending. But not, oh, what a delicate touch. What a, not a number 10. Mr. Boulard.